Hey guys, today we'll be talking about um, my hair tutorial, so hair video, I don't, I don't know what to call it, excuse this um, don't see him more bright light thing, stupid eyeball, um, yeah, so when I get out of the shower, <clears throat> or a bar, or after I wash myself, let's just say, I like to take, um, if I'm going to dry it with a hair dryer, I like to take this, the hair serum, I got it off one of my mom's friends for dry hair because I dyed my hair a lot, as you can see, as you probably already know, I dyed a lot, like, I think I was, I was seven when I first dyed my hair or something, like a highlight, my mom was trained to be a hairdresser and, yeah, she gave me pink highlights which later turned orange and I dyed my hair for the occasion nine, I'm not sure, so if I'm drying my hair, I'll take my um my Nikki car. Um very bare. Yeah. Usually with a diffuser and I'll dry it after I apply this and I'll apply I only apply the serum to my the light and then I apply this. It's a hot and big oh excuse me. Heat protective technology volume boosting root lift and shit. I know I like to have like little volume in my hair. So I use that and it smells really nice. And then my hair is at that awkward stage where it's it's not straight and it's not curly. It's really it's just that that stupid it has to be straightened or curled stage. So I usually straighten my hair and I'll straighten it with my Nikki Clark hair straightener. And it's really good. I need a new one though because it takes forever to heat up and it doesn't heat up the way it used to. Um, when I brush my hair, I can't use any small ass brushes. I have to use my big, and it's put in here, my big paddle brush because my hair is really thick. Like that's only a small section of it and it's really thick. Like it's knotted really easily. And usually when I brush my hair, I'll have to do it like outside because I shed like a dog does. So after I've dried and straightened, I'll play around with it for probably an hour trying to decide what way I put it up. So before I had got my get off, I would probably just throw it back into Eileen Jenner braids. Because it's that was right here until your I got back my neck. I'll probably wear them or this half up, half down bun. Or just if you know, I had my dreads in, I'd just keep it up like half up, half down, sort of shit. And since I got my death hawk, it's usually braids or this half up, half down shit or like this sort of, you would say a ballerina bun, except it's shaved on both sides. Or I'd leave it down as straight and or I'd have it over to the side. And I usually sleep with a braid in, so it's wavy in the morning. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I don't really do much else with my hair except for when I'm going out. And I usually curl my hair when I go out. Steps. Yeah, I usually curl my hair when I'm going out. So it's like curly, obviously. I don't like ringlets. So I spend like three hours doing beach waves. So once I have them done, I mousse the shit over. And I apply serum to like that much of my hair much of my hair because it's like really dry um and I'll hardly throw it over to the side if I put it up in a French quiz so that's the twisty thing it's twisted in the back and you can't see it or I'll put it up into like an up to or leave it down and usually by the end of the night it's up to the because I can cook my hair like especially when you're doing that's just me um yeah that's my um, hair video stuff. I'll probably make some tutorials of how I do my hairstyles. But yeah, other than that, that's it. I, I don't use any particular shampoos or anything like that. I just condition the hell out of the end of my hair because it's so bad. And yeah, that's it. So thanks for watching. Subscribe and hit the
Bye. Bye.